In this video, I'm gonna show you how to put the door handles on this frigid air refrigerator. So this refrigerator is brand new. And when it comes brand new, the door handles are not gonna be on the refrigerator. It's gonna come something like this, typically taped on the inside of the door. Uh, and you're gonna have plastic, I actually just removed all of it, at least on the left, on the right panel. On the left panel, you're gonna have plastic that looks like this. You're gonna have to rip it all the way off. Easier with two hands, but that's a step that you need to do prior to installing these. Otherwise, you're gonna put the handles on and there's gonna be plastic underneath. It's just gonna be an extra headache. So uh, go ahead and rip all this extra plastic off. Okay, I got enough of it off to keep going with this video. Uh, next step, once you have exposed your mounting pins, you're gonna open the door and you're gonna go ahead and get your uh, door handles off. Easy. Go ahead and remove the plastic and styrofoam from the handles. All right, I got all the plastic and styrofoam removed. So when you're looking at these stainless steel door handles, you're gonna see that there are two holes on either side and there happens to be an Allen wrench key screwable stem that tightens. Now in some models, you will see that you put it on and then you slide down and that locks it in place. In this specific model, that's actually not the case. You need to get the Allen wrench tool so that you can tighten this in. Otherwise that won't be mounted. Usually these instruction booklets come with the key. I was ripping through this hoping that it was in here and then I finally found it. The Allen wrench is right here. So I'm just gonna go ahead and bust this through the plastic. And uh, this is gonna be what actually goes inside right here to tighten it. So I'll pull this out and then uh, show you what it looks like when I'm tightening these arms. Okay, so uh, obviously there are two different ways you can mount it. You can either have the screws on the inside or on the outside. I prefer to have them on the inside because it, they're a little bit more camouflaged when everything is closed up. So that's how I'm gonna mount this, but you can do it however you want. So you get it positioned just like this, and then you're just going to twist clockwise to uh, to tighten it up. It goes about that far in, and then now it's nice and tight. Go ahead and do it on the bottom as well. They make this Allen wrench just long enough so that you can continue to spin it. I uh, really like that. It makes this so fast. Now I don't have to do a bunch of partial turns and taking it out, putting it back in, turning it half a turn. All right, want to get it just snug, not too hard though. All right, and then that handle is on. I'm gonna do the same thing on the other side. Probably only take a minute. I put the phone down so it actually only took a few seconds. Uh, but there you have it. It's very simple to put those arms on. Don't be intimidated by it. You could do this. I uh, love this refrigerator. Just so that you can see the model number, it's FRSS26L3A F7. This is a really nice frigid air refrigerator freezer. Arms went on nice and easy. You can do it, don't worry. Simple, only takes a couple minutes. I hope this video was helpful for you. Thank you for watching.